Hi, welcome to Talk Wheels. Let's talk about the Land Hopper. This title was registered with the Japanese Patent and Trademark Office not even a week after the 250 series premiered around the world. A new story from the Land of the Rising Sun says that the newcomer will make its debut at the Japan Mobility Show next month. This event, which used to be called the Tokyo Motor Show, will take place from October 25 to November 25. The Land Hopper is better thought of as the FJ Cruiser's indirect replacement, but Land Cruiser fans love to call it the Land Cruiser Mini. The body on frame 4x4, shown on the left side of the main picture, will be sold in Japan in the second half of 2024. What would make it a 2025 model? If there's a case for it in the US. People say that the Land Hopper, which is supposedly called something else, is the cheapest Land Cruiser in the group. It's said to cost less than 4 million yen. The article in question says that it is about 3 to 3.8 million yen, which is about 20k to $25,000 today. Under the hood, the Land Hopper isn't going to impress because it's so tough. Best Car thinks that the body on frame SUV will have 1.5 liter turbocharged three cylinder engines or 2.5 liter turbocharged four cylinder engines. 1.8 liter and 2.0 liter engines are also on the list of possible engines. But there is still a chance for mixed oomph. New Tacoma for sure? The best engine choice is the 2.4 liter turbo hybrid. For the Tundra, that's 3.4 liters, two turbochargers, and six cylinders. The Landhopper should have enough power for a small SUV with 219 horsepower and 252 lbft, 342 newton meters, if it gets the R84 Hybrid's 2.5-liter hybrid engine. To quickly review, the midsize FJ Cruiser had a 4.0-liter V6 engine and either a 6-speed manual transmission or a 5-speed automatic transmission. This engine, which has the codename 1GRFA, has 260 horsepower and 271 lbft, 367 newton meters of torque.